Hi, I'm Lori. And I'm Rick. And this is our puppy, Stormy. And we are Here We Go Again Camping. Guys, thanks for joining us. So we decided to do another video on a fifth wheeler that we went and checked out the other day. And it is a 2021 Jayco North Point 377 RL BH series. That's a mouthful. I memorized that. But campers, this is an awesome fifth wheel. I was very impressed. I think this is the best camper that we've actually looked at. Um, wish I had a truck to tow it because I might have been signing some papers. But uh, if you find this video helpful, give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel. Hit that notification bell so you can get our upcoming videos. But stay tuned for this. Hi campers, so here we are with the 2021 North Point by Jayco, fifth wheeler. It's the 377 RLBH series, and this thing is massive. Here's the floor plan, just to see how everything is actually Laid out. on the inside. Yeah, uh, one thing that I like about it, uh, it's got four slide outs, sleeps eight. Uh, there's three theater seating right across from the TV, which is, these things were so comfortable. Man, I would love to have these in our camper. Then you'd never leave. Yes, I would. I would every now and then. But there's there's plenty of uh, room to sit around on those rainy days on the inside. Lots of space in the kitchen. But you'll see that. And here is a picture of the front of the camper. You have massive slide out here for your master bedroom. Yes, for the queen size bed. It would be great if it was a king, but queen is good too. And the only thing I don't like about that the beds and a slide out is it's harder to make the bed. I feel other people may not be that way. Yeah, uh, but you can notice here there was three side outs on this side, lots of storage space on this side as well, which which is so handy for those dads that like to take too much stuff, as Lori would say. Yes, too many things. Here's your propane uh, tanks. There's also you, you'll see in the next picture it is uh, so convenient and easy to get to your leveling jacks, your water hookups, cable TV, light in here. So when you're pulling into the campsite late at night, you can still do all your hookups. and At midnight, which we have done before. Yeah, and that way you're not having to scream at a kid for uh, <laughs> not holding the flashlight or putting it straight in your eyes. That's not, true. Not that that's ever happened. Never there's, happened to here's me. Here's some uh, more uh, storage space in the front. I love, love that. This is the rear. I love this little. I know you do. The kids did too. They like playing with it. But this actually rolls out. It's a roll out storage area so for bigger items so you don't have to reach up. But then they have the sides that open Absolutely. up so you can get into the sides as well. So yeah, pretty and, handy. And here's your outdoor kitchen. Uh, you had our fridge, uh, griddle stone, which was so neat. Uh, it, it's folded out. And you can tell here there's a TV. Some campers don't like outdoor TVs, but hey, our son wanted to demonstrate this, so uh, you can't keep him away from electronics. Absolutely not. Indoor, outdoor, small, doesn't matter. And here, here's our other son with the uh, outdoor kitchen. It, it was so handy. I thought it was pretty neat that Jayco went ahead and threw this uh, nice little griddle stone in there. Uh, but you are paying for it. it. It came with a nice, hefty price. And here we go. Here's the kitchen. Island and all. It has a cutting board, like an extended uh, countertop, which is fantastic. A full-size refrigerator with an ice maker and water dispenser wow yeah <laughs> i never i don't think i ever take that much on on a trip but again this could be yeah. one that you can live in absolutely and lori mentioned this cutting board it gave you so much more space to prepare foods and stuff like that here uh, the tv actually popped up and you had your fireplace that's pretty nifty yeah it was and you got a nice big pantry in your kitchen as well I know you would love that. I would like that too. Yes, you are correct. <laughs> There's our daughter and our niece yeah. over there talking. Yeah. Uh, but, but there's the theater seats that Rick was saying he loved. I mean, they have lights that hang down. This is amazing to me. Yeah, it, this is just a beautiful camper. Jayco knocked it out of the park with this and, and more barn doors. I mean, they're, they're really up in the uh, interior on these things. And here's another cool thing to have if you have kids or even have maybe family that's going with you in with you in-laws their own little area to watch tv there's a bunk that actually pulls down there and that uh sofa makes into a bed so 
plenty of space for kids or for even adults that want to go with you. I think that's a great idea. You know, if you camp with other couples, they could have their own little space to get away from and, and get away. Uh, it's like a desk. Yeah, I mean, you could work from here. Uh, I actually think in the layout, it does talk about that it can be used for a, a desk. I mean, that's perfect to have, especially during this COVID time where a lot of people are homeschooling. Yeah, work from home as well. You know, work you from go home, camping. homeschooling, yeah. let's go. I may try that. I don't think that would work, but whatever. All right, so here we are heading towards the front end of the camper and the always bunk that is right there. Yeah, wanted to get the kids up there just to see how big it was. There's a lot of room. There is a lot of room. I, I'm, I mean, it's like a double size bed, yeah. actually. So, yeah. I mean, there's plenty of room and it has a uh, little, curtain. I guess, not curtain. It actually has like a wooden gate doesn't it up there to help secure them in yeah and here's uh the bathroom the kit or the bathroom sink i'm sorry yes um, backsplash and all which is really neat plenty of plenty of room yeah i remember the shower uh as well with the place that you could sit in it and stuff that, that is awesome that's pretty neat i mean it was it was a pretty big shower it was pretty big i mean you think with kids and stuff that's perfect oh yeah and i just you know the decor of this camper is, was very nice um uh, Here's the master bedroom. Uh, a little on the small side. Well, I mean, I with how it, far it sticks out, a little on the small side to me. Yeah, I mean, it, it's a queen bed, but I, I think this picture didn't do it justice. It's, you know, it, it just kind of appeared smaller than it actually was. So here we're going back through. Uh, you've got your hookup, TV hookups and everything there for... Uh, See, those are the things that I'm talking about. Okay, got your little <laughs> swindles to keep kids from rolling out. Yes. Uh, but, you know, you could... They got their little storage and whatever they want up there. It's a nice bed for kids. I mean, I'm sure ki our kids would love to sleep up there. Oh, well, yeah, and wrestle. Yeah, and, and here's the, the shower. Love this little, tons of space in here. I, what would make this better are doors on the linen closet. Yeah. So you could put, like, shampoo and stuff in there as you're traveling, but I'm being picky. You can still put linens up there. If they fall out, they fall out. Yeah, check his shower matter. head out. I mean, it's it's very nice. I mean, I don't like the fact that there's only one bathroom, you know. Yeah. A little no privacy or whatever, the, the, the glass. But as you can see here, sun running over there. Huge closet space in this, the yes. front end. But Oh, no, it does. That picture sh did no justice yes. for this whatsoever. There, I mean, this actually looks bigger than what the picture showed. Yeah, but uh, as mentioned there's a hamper here uh in that closet also washer and dryer print hookups. also a kid yeah you know he actually came home with us <laughs> but you know here i mean i think lori would have a difficult time would have to climb over and i mean anybody would have a hard time walking on the sides of this thing hey, i think i would deal with it i would deal I, with i mean you. i could deal with it yeah. i'm just saying i know you are just something to think about if, if that's one of your pet peeves. But a little more room. Yeah, there's a little bit room here. You've got your TV here. Also had a little dresser. Um, I don't even know what that is. I don't, is that like a little desk? I'm guessing so. So here's your prep, as we had mentioned earlier, washer and dryer prep. So that's pretty cool. I mean, this thing's ready to be lived out of. I opinion. like the mirrors too, because yep. there's never a good place to put a mirror, I don't think. But yep. big closet, master closet. No complaints with that whatsoever. It's just I wish there was more on the sides of the bed. Yeah. So all in all, guys, we really love this fifth wheel. So if you get a chance, go check one out. Hi, campers. Thank you for watching our video. We really appreciate all the support. And guys, if you want to check out a previous video, click up here. And if you want to become a subscriber, and we hope that you do, click down here. Also, you can check out some of our apparel over here. But until next time, safe travels and God bless everyone. Bye.